question in Spanish, and then we'll move to the rest of it for English, okay? One yes. in Spanish, first, and then everything else in English. Thank, Thank you. Muchas gracias. Eh, Mauricio, muchísimas felicidades en primer lugar por lo que hoy. Eh, además, ha habido una ceremonia espectacular en la que seguro que os habéis imbuido todos vosotros. Eh, ahora que habéis vivido todo esto, me gustaría que intentases abstraerte de ello y me dijeses que podéis intentar prometer para la próxima temporada eh, después de todo lo que hemos vivido hoy. Habéis conseguido un montón de puntos contra los equipos grandes, eh, en casa habéis sido un fortín. ¿Qué podéis prometer para el año que viene? ¿Qué, ¿Cómo podéis ilusionar a la afición y cuáles son las herramientas para ello? Bueno, primero es que es muy difícil eh, abstraerse de todo lo que hemos vivido hoy. Eh, sería para, para mí imposible poder eh, hablar con con frialdad o con tranquilidad de lo que va a pasar la temporada que viene. Yo creo que se ha hecho un trabajo fantástico, creo que terminar segundo, ahí muy cerquita de y haber peleado toda la temporada por, el, por ganar la Premier League ha sido una, una cosa muy bonita para el club, eh, para los jugadores. Eh, y la próxima temporada intentaremos otra vez estar ahí peleando y tratar de, de hacer las cosas bien, mejorar, porque siempre lo importante es mejorar. Eh, pero yo creo que lo más, eh, lo más importante es eh, ver nuestros nuestro fans o nuestros jugadores, eh, todo lo que han, lo que han dado, lo, la gente lo que ha recibido, la gente lo que no ha, no ha dado al equipo. Y yo creo que hay eh, también una cierta excitación para la próxima temporada. Sabemos que tenemos que dar lo mejor de nosotros. Va a ser una temporada complicada porque nos vamos de Guajar Lane y porque va a ser un año de transición donde vamos a, a jugar en Wembley. Pero lo que está claro es que la gente sabe que, que el club necesita este, este, este empujón y este apoyo, sobre todo en la próxima temporada. Los jugadores lo saben, el staff, yo mismo, nosotros. O sea que eh, esperemos que sea una temporada exitosa otra vez. La temporada que viene trataremos de tomar las mejores decisiones para tratar de ayudar al equipo a poder conseguir algo importante y bueno, yo creo que estamos en un buen camino eh, de cara al, al futuro de este club. Well, I think uh, it was a very emotional game, it was a very emotional ceremony and um, it's so difficult to, to split all, no, and to describe. Uh, I think it was a uh, I am a very like a very lucky guy because uh, to share uh, the history of this uh, such of, of club uh, in that uh, special moment is, is so lucky that we to be here and I'm, I'm so so happy. Uh, um, I want to congratulate all and to say thank you to all the players, the fans, the staff, my my staff because. Uh, Uh, all together we worked so hard to try to, to achieve uh, uh, all that we achieved this season. Uh, really sad because, disappointed because uh, Chelsea on the end, uh, they won the Premier League, but uh, nothing to regret. Um, very, very, very happy with the performance of the player and everyone. And only now, for now, is uh, to say to our fans, to say everyone that we will try next season to try to give our best and, and try to fight again for 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 win the try to win the the league. How did you feel when you were out on the pitch and everyone was singing your name? Yes, it was uh, yes, it was very 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 nice for me. Uh, I want to say thank you uh, all the, the the love and the. Uh, that energy that is, uh, is fantastic, is special. Um, yes, I think was a was very special moment for for me. But I think is uh, for all my staff, uh, all the the the, the, the club staff, uh, the, the, the the player. Uh, I think all deserve the the love that the, the fans show today. This confirms that you, you finished in second. It's you know it's yeah. the highest for, for for many many years. I mean, with the new stadium and, and moving there, can it be the platform to really? Yes, we were talking a lot, and I think we believe that the, when the new stadium uh, opened the, the door, uh, the door uh, will will help will help the, the club to, to achieve uh, to reach the, the last level. Uh, that is our uh, expectation. That is our uh, idea. Um, 
Yes, sure, sure. Because uh, the facilities uh, and the training ground, the, the new facilities that with the new stadium, will put the, 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 the team and the club in the in the in the last level on uh, on, on, on Europe. What souvenirs have you been taking from here? No, still nothing because uh, no time to to, <laughs> to, 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 to take nothing. But uh, we'll see what, what uh, things are there, are still there, because I think the player or the people start to to take <laughs> everything. <laughs> What's your assessment? Do, do, do you have one memory that stands out from your time at White Hart Lane being a manager as a, a game or a moment that really sticks with you and you remember forever? I think now it will be for always uh, the last day. And, uh, and I think for me it was a very exciting day uh, because I think it was perfect. Uh, the preparation of the game, the game, we played well and we got the three points. And on the end, uh, all the ceremony was fantastic with the, to share with all the legends, the people, the staff, uh, the fans. I think with the family, I think for me it will be always the most special day, the, the last day of Wakarlai. Thank you very much.